there are two parents who came here one day from Chibuye Prayer Palace. The pastor of Prayer Palace sent them to me for counseling. And now they are quarreling over everything. And uh, they argued over everything. The husband told me that his wife was beyond consideration of any level of decent women. Because one day when they were she told the husband that even this, oh, the, it's the, the husband children. who said, I think, and she threw that even the children that you gave me here are useless. Like about 20 feet away. A three month baby. About And people shouted. police. They got hold of her and took her to the police. Then later they came here and talked to me and I told them to have her released and bring her over so that I can cancel her. I don't want you to get, uh, you're going to get money. But it should be good people. Amen. Be good people. Let that money turn you into good people. Amen. Amen. God will never use money in our lives to build our egos. Katonda, takoze sanga ko sente kubanga atulete lokuberanga tufunobu awatido. Oh, it doesn't give us children so that we may torture other children. Amen. Amen. If he gives you children, those children should treat other children you're looking after well. Amen. 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 Because ego is evil in the sight of God. This money is not going to make you a very powerful person in the sense of making other people you know, feel bad. You see, many people build their egos they are trapped by financial ego I told you today of uh, that man in the morning he is still, he's still alive but very poor and he has lost all that thing he, all, the, all that he used to possess at Kololo and everywhere because all he thought about was I can't give my tithe for me in this church I don't talk about those things a lot Amen. Amen. I'm expecting you to be mature enough this church is the first one in the revival Amen. Amen. And so there are certain lessons I don't want to keep on repeating concerning tithing, offering, uh, being uh, supportive to the kingdom of God in one way or another. Many Christians, many Christians receive money. 
and they can do a lot with that money in the kingdom of God. But they're often trapped by financial ego. Financial what? The things I can't do. But you know, when my friends became pastors, they increased to bishops. And that's okay. Bishops are also men of God. But for me, I don't want to have a title that is meant to raise my ego. Amen. Amen. I'm a professor, okay, I'm a doctor, but that is something I read for. Chancellor has a duty, have a duty in the world as a chancellor. Amen. 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 There's those are just duties. Pray the Lord. Everything, even when you have money, Money should not be for your ego. But it should be for you a duty, the things you're supposed to do in the world. And the things that you want to do more urgently than others because they are personal, but sometimes you may need not to do them so that may do other things which God wants you to do. Amen. 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 My ego, tell your name. Must, must also be trapped by financial ego. Amen. Amen. Pray the Lord. And even uh, we, Dr. Silly and I, can give you an example. We may be very powerful people in the world, but she's not proud of being a pastor's wife. She doesn't have any ego. This one is a very highly educated. Praise the Lord. But I've never seen a girl like this I've seen many, but she's one of the most, most humble, educated people. Many people cater to the wealthy in this country. Amen. Um, there are other people who cater for them. Who cater to them. A, a rich person cannot become rich without somebody else catering to them. Amen. That wealth is catered to you by another. You understand? Somebody else catered to you to have what you have. Tell somebody this achievement I have was catered to me by other people. Professor 
Oyinzo kuba kare nga gwene school fees zari ziganye. Ni waba uomu tuwa mulalaga mancho wange. Deka nkwa ato mwano oyo. Oyinzo kuba nga mwano oyo yalina mule kwa. Oyinzo no kuba nga yalina abazad. Na gamba deka mwano oyo mwerele. Na mwerele, na malo kusoma, na afuno muli mwogwa manye nyo, na gagawala. Kati obuga gobo waba afunye. Abasi ya wetu sizako. Wali uo mtu katonda gwe ya kukosesa. Na amura vidira. Na sobolo kufuno obuga gobo. Na abala ratuli wano. Kalo inzo kubanga toina ya kuwe edera. Na inga wa, ya uwebu edu. Na inga ya limu zadeo. Omu zade na yere kere zabiyo na. Na yere kere ze saati mpia. Na mama na yere kere ze chitete ya chipia. Na basa sura fizi. Na bajanga kusomero kulaba. Na bakuletere mbere nge. Bere kere za katunda ya bako ze sa. Okula birira. Erebu omalo kusoma gwe doktor gwe engineer. Gwa akola muyueni. Gwa akola uwa. Obuga gobo katunda buwa kuwa de. Juki na ntisigu wa wajiru usako. Na ya ino mtu omala lago ya koze sa. Osobolo kufuna obu gaga. Ena kuzino tuliba lokore. Tuja moka nisa. Abamo tuja nge mbera. Ensi ya tukuba akubada. Nga tolina buori. Buli omua kunyoma. Buli omua kusekerera. Buli choko la chiganye. Emili mujiganye. Buli goko la guegufa. Kapito nafa na guawo. Noje uo musumba. No mgema musumbe mbere nyize. Na musumba na kusabira. No funo obu gaga. Buofuno uga gobo, tuwera vira, chukira katonda alino motu kwea kwezesa, na akura virira, na imirira na awe mumbereyo, nusuvoro ukufuno uga gobo. Sometimes, olusi, it is poorer people that cater to you. Babera na bantunga bavu dala abakura virira. Ngomu jukiru msajjo uwe mbare mumu jukiru abwa ibamo kubanyo maulire. Mwamu laba, ya linye nyonye, umsajjo ono, Yari afuga kagari. Nga kakolea kwa sente. We mbali. Kakati ni wabera uo mwana. Yari kusomero. Nga tata we ya fa. Na inga mama ya harabi dila mwana. Mwana na mtu wala kusomero. Kati nga tewali mtuye na chari na mwana. Yunga wabera mwana kubane wabera balia. Nga tunula wati. Na yu msaji orumu. Na tunulido mwana. Na gamba mwana ono. Kati kwe kumubuza. Na mga mamuna nge. Mama tali na chari na. Na hii mbira huko sumiru, tata umsajja ya limu kade nga avuga kagari. Na sala wage nenga achariru mwana kusumiru. Nga muavu mozibu. Na hii wachiri, sima njipo ya gamba nga mchara we. Nga wachiri ya jane mbire ngo vane ebinyebwa. Ngo mwana tamu manjina ko. Na mchari da kusumiru jialinga. Na muwele da nobu sente, na muwele da na muongera yo. Umana na malo kusoma. Umana boya malo kusoma na jukira. Na gamba mkama. Wali uo mtu guo wako zesa. Ye ya jukira mkama ya muwe chisa. Na agenda muita. Bari babiri. Nene iba. Na yali mchara. Na aba ita. Na agamanti. Wachiri. Kambeke chintu chenko. Lino muami ono. Asanyuke. Katina muteka tekera. Nibagula tikti. Eye nyonyi. Na alinye nyonyi. Umami. No mchara uyo babiri. Baba laga nyoma ulire. Wamu haba laba. Katina alinye nyonyi. Na aba tuare Nairobi. Nebali eche misena in Nairobi muoteri enonji. Nebali bali bali kunyonyi. Abako zuo mnyonyi nebavayo. Nebaga mabanange. Tulina abantu abenja urube tu atambude na boku nyonyi kuno. Neka tiyono mami na omchala. Nga tiba sola na kweba na mkrasi abantu abenja uro. Na ye nebavayo. Nebaga matituwa gara tuba anjulire. Umami irinyandiera bide na omchala. Kubanga bali kuromuli mogu enja uro. Neba imirira. Neba babu ulira cheba kule nyonyi yona. Newe chitibu abantu bano wabini neba kube engaro. Abantu neba basima abantu neba wanebi intu. Ebi enja ulo. Kuoro enyonyi ya uma wa msajono. Avuga akagari. Edaba amuja akagari ke embare eri. Neba lioka wa mteka kunyonyi. Neba mtu wale Nairobi na akomao. Umuvubu kana agama atuwachiri mkama. Echo china amara. Ebi lala na akola na yecho. Kasa nyokobu la mbubu wana. Um. About one year ago, uh, Pastor Rere and Pastor Robert Kayanja came to visit me after our anniversary. Pastor Kayanja 
apologize that he had not been around. What touched me is that the, the, their coming was voluntary. I never invited them. Amen. Amen. And uh, that pleased me very much. Because if you want to do something for God, you can be you can do something that is voluntary. Without being invited to do it. Me? And then when Dr. Celia came out uh, out of her bedroom and, and met Robert Kayanja. Dr. Celia, we are from Chisengo, Kujoksisinkana, Robert Kayanja. He stood up. Na and bowed before her. And said, You are the mother who looked up to me. Amen. And say, Thank you for looking after me. Out of his pocket, a big sum of money, and gave it to her. Dr. When I looked at that, I blessed him. Amen. 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 Because it was appreciation of somebody who catered for you. I've catered to many people. Many pastors. Some have come back to bless me, others have not. Amen. Amen. They're enjoying what came out of the blessing. Amen. Have you understood? But they don't know that one day they can lose all of it. They have and they have to come back and say, give me more. A blessing is not nothing. I used to think it was nothing because people would freely say, God bless you, God bless you, which didn't make any sense to me. But when I looked at it, since I met Jesus, I know that a blessing involves angels. A true blessing. I want a child of three years to come here. Three. Three. This child, three years old, um, the Bible says that the angels are close to the Father. They're always there every day. When this child is sick, somebody who blesses them, the angels see directly. Now I'm going to bless this child. That she shall be a great, great woman. And she shall have money and she will be very happy. And after I've done that, the devil comes and tries to remove her blessings. So, when I see that, I fast. One, two, the third day. Oluna Kurusoka, Noro Kubiri, Oro Kusatu, Nakongo Kana Gueri. 
fast for your families. Amen. Amen. Because once a person has been blessed, the devil will likely come and try to destroy that blessing. But what I've said to this child shall come to pass. Hallelujah! Amen. It, a blessing is real. Watch the child. Hallelujah! Pray the Lord. Not only that child, but watch you. Watch you. Robert, can you remember the Days he was here and said, Professor Simeon. Omusumba Robert Kayanja yadjukire nakuzi yaliwa no nagamba Professor Simeon. It is you who taught us to preach. Gwe. We have came from you. Name kisa jonaje tulina java gwe. It really made me feel good. Because he did not behave as the devil. Kubanga to ye sanga sitan. Who fights God? Amen. Hallelujah. Who made him? Pray the Lord. I want you to do the same. Always blessing. Jesus says, go and fish. Get some money and pay for yourself. And for me. If this child remains uh, dilapidated, leaking all the time, this church, and he has blessed you, he might take away from you what he has given you. Amen? There's always a reason why people don't do what they're supposed to do. There are excuses every day. And the devil will always bring up those excuses. When you look at the book of James, it gives us a very clear the ad- admonition not to fawn over the wealth, the wealthy. In Christ, we are all financially equal. Tell your neighbor that. If you don't understand it, tell your neighbor that. We are all financially what? We are all financially equal. Why? Why? Because the things of this world will quickly pass away. So when God looks at your finances, rich or poor, you have nothing. It's all about in the future. Are you sad? Eh? Rich or poor, we are financially equal, so there should be no ego. When they met an angel, one of those spiritual uh, journeys, not on this plane, but on another plane. There were several of them in a little, in a kind of office. 
And then one of them said, Kai, will you go and do this and this in the world? I told him, that it's not your responsibility to send me to do those things. <laughs> We're both of us servants. A servant cannot send another servant. It is Jesus yes. who will send me to do this, not you. Professor. <laughs> And he got, he cringed and went out of the room, went out of the room and hid himself. Before God, angels and men, and men are creatures are the same. Bamalaika nabantu bonabi tonde erabe nkanankana. I didn't do wrong. I I I he was telling me to do something which maybe was his job. He was not a demon. He was an angel of God. Can you, can you explain what I said? <laughs> But the warning on Pulidizang and David Dalicho Professor Chiacola Chizimu or Cola Nayatan is Yuki and Nemo Bible, Yokana Yafuno Quali Seboa. Boya Funo Quali Sevolo Malaika Guyalava Katimukutia Nayala one see Masoga Malaika Namgamba Vau Nawe Toina Kusin Zanze, Sinza Katonda Kubanga Nange, Dimuere Zamuno Amina. Yes, Kati. Ne professor Chiakola we wow professor Sicha Angunyo Nenga Charlie Chitufu. So I didn't do the work you to, you are telling me to do. Kati no mo limu goyari antu mo kola sa kola. And I came back. Nengo mau. Not feeling guilty at all about anything. Gasiri na na che empuli danti ova mo na genga empuli da bobi nyokbanti na magambi ebigambi. But when I tell you. Na ya te gwe nkugamba. Things I am supposed to be your pastor, you must do them. I Hallelujah! Amen. Pray the Lord. Explain also what you think. Professor Akugambi, Ntie Agenda Muguru, Malaika Namugamba, Abeke into Biakola Consicuno, Nagana. Nam Gamba sit Jacobicola, yes, Suja Joe Untuma, being in Dembi Cole. A Yantuma Rudis. Eran a Rudi, a Yantuma, a Tenga name and Rudi, a Yam Sissin, can ye, Eran Amutu may be into Nabicola, Polo Nagana. Eragam betai nachi into your nachi, a woody anti of our leader of Vinti, a Jamie. Naya take gwe, Buaku Gamba, O Kuba Kabin to be again do cola, Gendo be cole, Kubanga muye, Mulimoya Mutuma. Yaba yogera nawe era gende ebintu ebyo bikole bwaba chikugambye chibera lwabulunji bwo bwono jema egono olaba echina kutuka ku when i tell you do something when kugamba okuba ko ne chintu chokola i'm not telling you what you must not do i'm telling you what i know Basi you should do basikugamba chotolina kola na yenkugamba cholina kola amen amen i know what you should do and what you should not do manyi cholino kola ne chotolina kola I told Dr. Boas' daughter Dr. Boas to give me her glasses. To give me her glasses. She was born uh, unable to see. Without glasses, she would not walk anywhere. Now, uh, I removed them from her. And they are Yes, years now. Since then, she's still able to see. But 
the spirit of God did not tell me to remove glasses from Dr. Bowers. Na yate umoyo wa mukama teyangamba kujja kutata we glass ya Garubindi Dr. Bowers. But for he, so Bowers is using glasses. Ne kakati wetu ogerera Dr. Bowers atambula ne Garubindi. And but his daughter healed. Na yate muwara we yeya wonyezewa. But the two are friends are they're not jealous of each other. Na yeka tibombi tata ayagala omwana na omwana ayagala tata we. When God blesses a blesses a friend of yours. Katonda bwawa mukwano go mukisa. And does not bless you. Gwenata gukuwa. Don't be angry. Tonyiga. Be like Dr. Boaz and daughter. Bera nga Dr. Boaz ne mwara we mosanyo kireko. Mukama fe banswe. Zenza kuogera ku kintu kiriye cha professor cha yogedde cha malaika ba malaika ba muri mulanka nafe ngabo twina ba pastor bayina lanka kati singa yali arch angel nga yagamba professor awo yali yali ino ko beyinga if he was michael or gabriel yali ino ku gonda niyo lo kuba malaika oli yali lower in rank to the professor yali yali tasobola kumulagira so ba malaika bayina lanka Ngana fe mbantu wetu ina lanka. Kati malayi koyo ya itasobu na kulagida professor. Singa ya liga abdiya unamu gamba kolachi maria mo ino gonda. <laughs> so, in Christ we are all financially equal. Kati mu Christo, fena mubiobu gagwa tuwinka na hakana. We have a heart, each one of us to give according to our measure. E chiteke Amen. zanti buli omu. Amen. Oyo kuwa yo, ngabu olina. Katonda buwa kuwade. Knowing that things will, things of this world will quickly pass away, pass away. Ngochimanyi nti ebintu bienseno, mangu dalabija kugwao. Death will remove all wealth from us. Obu kufa, kujia kutuja kubulichimu. There's a man called, I think, I've forgotten his name. Wali wa msajia gwenera videri nya. Who was, he was very rich indeed, I think he was about 42 years or 32 years. I watched his burial on TV. Um, I forgot his name. But they buried him with his, some of his money. What was it? Semwanga. <laughs> Semwanga. And I know. According to my imagination. After the burial. Some thieves went and stole that money. They were showing him that the money was not his anymore. What <laughs> What happened? Nuta ya vamos mayo. Nuta ya ndo za ya lisa wa ya gold. Yeah. Nuta ya is, uh, I know Nuta ya because he was in Gomba. Nuta ya ya ni muna Gomba. His parents, Fide. his parents taught me in P1. His, his mother. Mama we, ya so me sa professor in P1. Mama wa Fide Nuta <laughs> I know that family very well. But can you imagine that even Rutaya is not alive now? I was listening to one of the announcements made and uh, somebody was commenting on the announcement. Pastor <laughs> We are saddened by the death of Professor Kaiwa. This is the news that we have in Uganda. Can you imagine? <laughs> that would be like the news circumstances would be like that after me. Suppose that after I died, that would be the circumstances. Therefore, use your money and real property while you are still alive. And everything may end up, you know, <laughs> But we are saddened by the death of so and so. 
See, so when Christ, when we as Christians meet again, in heaven maybe there will be lots of surprises. Some will have crowns. And are placed in the char- in charge of cities of God. And those who will be, though, and there will be also some others that would have used to build their egos. They, they would have used so they would not be given crowns to build the cities of God. And if you're using your money to build your ego, so let the rich man Katino. glory in humility in, in, in a humility. Chino chitu yigiri zenti abagaga benyumiri zenga mkweto waza. Write this down. Let Echo the rich ike, tireko mugaga. Glory in humility and in use of his money humbly to help others build the kingdom of God every rich man should do that Amen for the, the sun rises with a scorching wind. And withers the grass. And withers the grass. And its flower falls off. And the, the, the wind is not natural. The wind is natural. The wind is natural. And also the hailstones are natural. But you should learn from them. You grow your bananas and you're proud of them. The scorching sun comes and burns them. And also, what else happens? The, uh, the, the, uh, the hailstones, uh, it may rain in a small way, but the hailstones will come down and wa- wash and, and break your, your planting and everything. And the beauty of the appearance of your banana trees is destroyed. I'm giving that as a proverb to you. When you're walking on the street and you find uh, uh, banana trees in Gomba or somewhere on TV which have been destroyed. Those are the banana trees which the rich man was proud of. But rain has destroyed their appearance. Many things can be destroyed like that. Everything that you're proud of so the rich man in the midst of his pursuits the Bible says he will fade away what can you sing for us
Thank you, Calvary Cross. Hallelujah. Amen. This does not mean that to have riches is evil. Even when I was talking to that angel, I did not speak out of ego or pride. There are the Lord had to know that I know the protocol of God. Amen. Let me tell you another story. One day I was walking. Today it's up to you to believe me or not, but I don't tell a lie. Again in that plane, because the one who sent me from the very beginning here was from a different plane. That's why I keep on going to see him in where he is. Amen. I didn't come from a Bible college. Sava na mo Bible college inti oban soma musomero ya Bible. Elder God, God is a, an elder of the church that I one, one visited at Kaboa many years ago when I just been called. He knows I was, not, I was not led to Christ by anyone. No one. It's only Jesus. So I know him. Mumani. He called me himself. You may call me an ordinary pastor. Thank Thank you you very very much. Much. The work I'm doing is not ordinary. I'm ordinary though, but the work I'm doing is not ordinary. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Only people don't go out announcing that that Bin Laden will die on this day, whatever. You don't tell you about uh, global darkness will happen. In... Because they don't have that communication. But for me, I know that if the Lord wanted me to say it, I, he will communicate to me, not that angel. That angel was not supposed to tell me that. Even angels, angels make mistakes. <laughs> eh? They also make mistakes. Amen? Amen? When they see that we are human beings. Kubanga. And sometimes Satan makes mistakes. He thinks he will do you harm. But I'm raising my hand over <laughs> you. That's a mistake. He will not touch you. He will not touch you. Hallelujah. Amen. But you should know one thing that all this wealth that we are getting tonight is going to make you happy, but you fade away. Amen. Yes. Amen. Don't forget that. Don't be sad about that. Because there's life that will never end. And I've seen it myself. This time when I was going away, I told you I reached a, po a point where I knew that I had been disconnected from the earth. I had gone not to come back this time. But I received order from Jesus. Go and preach the gospel. 
So I'm preaching with authority. Some people don't like the things I do, but I must do them because the Lord who sends me. Kati imbuli na nabo yinza abantu abamu tebogera bintu tebagara bintu biyenkola na yate ni no bikola kuvanga mukama yeyantuma. Those who are writing in the papers. Ababa wandi kama mupapla zama odiri. Those who threaten me that they're going to do this and that to me. Abanti sati sati baje kunkola chino bachiiri. They can't. They can't. Jeba sobola. Because it's the Lord who sends me to do the things. Hallelujah. Amen. But God will not allow Christians to hold money, to pile up money on your account when he has given you that Money as a mean, a sign of assignment you have in this world. Don't ask me what does the Lord want me to do. Somebody asked me that and I say, go to your account. Your bank account will tell you. Account will tell you. Account will if you can't really understand. The other day a horse, a, 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 a donkey spoke to Balaam. A prophet. Now you tell your neighbor. Don't ask me what the Lord wants you to do. Go to your account. The Lord wants you to do this. Go to your account. And your bank account will talk to you. Your account will talk to you. Your bank account will talk to you. bank account will talk to you. Your bank account will talk to you. Your Your bank account, account here, your joy in our bank. has your assignment. Otherwise, in heaven, you will not build cities. You would have been building your ego. Tell your neighbor, are you building your ego? Or are you building the kingdom of God? But we'll tell them to go to their account. I'll talk to them. Ngambira mulirwana onto manyi katonda che yakutumokola. Agambi atya. Mugambe boba to manyi. Genda kwa account yo. Account ye ne kubuli da. Akati wali wa gamba otio sina account e yange nkalu. Go to your pocket. Go to your, go, go to your pocket. Professor Chagambi e yo buevanga nkalu. E da katonda chimanyi wali we vida la via kutumio kola. Ate da chimanyi ya dekati nkalu. Very soon, again, the Kuveda Kusente. Amina. So, Tobia Jam no Gamba. Ah, ah, Katiguajirina Jitunuri de Ofune, Choino Korea Katonda, Ata Jirina, Zigenda Puja Zivereko, O Kole Mukama, Chayagal O Kolochia, O Kole. Amina. This girl, when I first met her, a house. She was one of the basiuf, the most basiuf. Omwalo no na soko musi sinkane wa we yo muku basiuf bosi bolo kroza ko. They also live in one room. Atenga baba era mukasenge kamo. At one degree. In one degree. In a mad, mad world house. Ngane nyumba ba jukubisa budongo. The windows were. From, I think leaves, so dry banana leaves. Was it, it was really windy. Eh? There, was no, there was no window in the house. Small room. How many children were there? Four children. Bana. Eh? And the parents. There was no, only one bed. For parents. For the rest of them. 
They will bury their heads under the bed. The bed. Galanti, buliri bwa wansi ngane mitu vajite kwa wansi mumu uwechita nda. It was terrible. Embera yari nzibo. So I went to the place. Nengenda. I don't know where I would sit. I went there with Dr. Cecilia. And then I said, and I said, I'm kicking you out of this in a week. Remember, it's the hand of God that gives you the power to become rich. And they began, and her mother Mama we. got a job from the Chinese. And they bought, they gave, her, they gave them money to buy land. And to build a house. Was it? In how long? In, in one month only, they built the land. House. And they gave, gave them transport also. Transport. Transport. They became very wealthy. In the church here, we began to see them as people with names. Big names. And, no, they've never done that. When she began to travel to South Africa, to wherever. But she, she spent some of her money for her family and some for me. Na ye sente ze zimu ya ziteka ku family ye atenda la na azinde etera. Sorry that when I was sick uh, in the hospital when I was sick when I was sick my mother died. You know my mother. Mama way na agendo kubira ni muka mawafe. But a friend of mine mawafe. Jennifer Jennifer Yeah you know remember she was here? Mumu manyi mchala kawesa Mrs. Kawesa she died. Ya agendo kubira ni muka mawafe. But all the children left behind have property. And they have Jesus. Jesus shifted them. Shifted them in one week. Was it one week? One month only. They left that Kayumba. Kayumba Kali Aketaka. A Kayumba Kali Kabibanang. It was very ugly. And when I looked down Which stand? under the bed there was a bone. I don't know whether they had shared that the whole family had shared the bone. I'm wondering how they had shared the bone. It was full of safari ants. Safari ants. And the small house was behind a big house. Those things, I have a God in heaven. I have a power to change. So, in his name, but not without ego. But in his name that may be glorified. The conditions that she, she got in her life, the, the family were very happy, I mean the parents to the end of their lives. And this is a wonderful thing. Ask her to tell you the rest of the story. Hallelujah. Abanyabo neba sebo katonda chia kutumo kolo Bero chimanya ero chitegera Norecho buli omu nonya Cho ino kola Kat professor Bwendo wazeza kuchidi chotu gambi Malaika e Ya kugambo kole chintu no gamba No mugamba siya ino kugamba Ndo waza chenji zewo Ntinewe tuwa tulota Oba tufunye vision ni waba malaika E na mukama ino tuwa spirit of discernment No manyancho no malaika changamba Ne wangu badesi malaika wa sitani. Buandibanga sibu vunanyi ziwa wange. Kanoza professor ye. 
Eyo spirit of discernment ya liya jina ya deyafuno okole Sebu angalaba alimu guru Atenga ne malaika siwa achizikiza Yali malaika ye njini njini Nena ategeda chino changa mbo kola Sinza ino kola chi Okuchikula kakati na fefena Nga wetu gagawala wetu funa sente Mukama atuyambe tubele sensitive Nebo funa vision Era mukama akuyambo okutegeda Anti malaikonu ya dewa katonda Lewi kachanga mba si change Ova change all, all the same, what I'm trying to tell you, something distinct here is that we should never have an ego. Even in serving God, don't say I'm a great man. I'm greater than some angels. No. I was talking about God's work. My, my duty to God, and the angel knew it. He was angry with me. Amen. And I think God also had brought the angel over to me so that I may know whether I can discern. <laughs> I think it was a test. Have you understood? Pray the Lord. So, uh, there should be a difference between saving and holding. Kakati, wali no kubera we njaulo, wakati uo, okubango otele kesente, ati no kubango zituma. Amen? Amen. Uh, when the Lord gives you a lot of Kati money, mukama buwa kuwe sente nyingi. Don't tell a lie like, 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 like Ananias and Safira. Togeza no oli imba anga Ananias and Safira. Sina sente nemu? I don't have any money on me. Hii. You don't even have a coin. Surely. Ask your neighbor. Are you sure you don't have even a coin in your pocket? Logamba, I don't have even a coin in my, my, my pocket. I don't have money at all. Surely. You mean you don't have any money on you? But you can tell them. I have money but it's not uh, going to be used in the plan you have. Because you see some thieves will also come. They're hearing now. They say after here I'm going to tell Pastor Professor Simeon that I have been in town and my money has been stolen. And uh, there was a, a, a confusion in the city when a bomb blasted. When I looked around, my bag was gone. I have no, no place to sleep except and then uh, I, I've, I've got to walk right now back to Fort Porto. And I know one, and I know no one in the city. How, how did you come to the city? When you didn't know anyone. <laughs> I will tell you. Go to police and sleep there. God bless you. <laughs> That's what I mean. You have to have wisdom. Pastors should not come and deceive you and steal God's money you have. Amen. Amen. Even some beggars are thieves. Have you ever seen, have you ever seen a beggar in a movie? He was, he was crawling. And all the cars stopped. And some gave him some money. When he crossed the road, he began to 
Waliwo na akalala yali asabiriza abantu ne bamuwe sente kati ne waba omo bya mulaba nga bamuwadde sente na jazz tole mu mukasowani bwe yazitwala yayimuka na musimba ko Haleluya Amen Praise the Lord. Somebody was telling me yesterday. This phone is going to be uh, locked in five minutes. I know your name is Mr. Kaiwa. According to our records here in MTN. We are locking you up in only five minutes. I told him why all the hurry. First of all, I'm not even a mister, I'm a professor. Okay, now, now that you're a professor, I'm going to give you some kind of... Uh, Abeyance, the, the, abeyance, the punishment will come later. <laughs> but you got, can you give me, do you want to use the, your old uh, money, money, mo, mo, mobile money code or you want a new one? Na ye to cause a sa code ye, the pinny and cut day, a mobile money, nina kuere zempia. Can you do it now, right? Do it, everyone. Can you do it now, right? Do it, everyone. I'm suspicious of you. I told you I'm suspicious of you. Why all the hurry? Why all the hurry? Why all the hurry? This looks like, what kind of mufere are you? I don't know what mufere is. I don't know what mufere is. <laughs> he, he, he hung up. Up to now, the phone is still working. He was a thief. Have you understood? Be careful about such people. Okay, Bible says, Lord, I ask but two things from you. First, help me to never tell a lie. I ask you, how old are you? How many of you are going to speak the truth? Public servants, Scales, <laughs> Katonda <laughs> Na hii mkamera na amponya. Kati nga muenda, November, last year, I made 60. Walu wala di? Walu wala di? Walu wala di kansa? Kansa walu wala di? Na walu wala kansa wanu ne wajange chisimba ne babo tura. Ribs unu ne zibangazi. Na dira banzi? E, zaari nkumi 2001. 2001. Hmm. 
kakati 2022 yes e yali agendo kufira dala cancer kakati mula mutoni katula chata so akola muangale na bengana za mozo nda haleluya katonda muangase mwa insonete gedi katonda ya gabachi haleluya so you must never tell a lie tolimbanga second give to me neither riches no poverty you know the person don't misunderstand that riches which are going to be helpful god give me amen obugago bugende okunyamba mukama abumpe make me happy and make other people happy give me that mbere musanyu fu abumpe i don't want to say i should be poor because my poverty is still but even rich people still this is a funny prayer kind of sagala kumuga amanti ampo bwavu kubanga bagaga baba nanyi nabavu baba but it's not good in, a, in this prayer there's that i should not be i don't want to be in a state where i have no cont- i want to be contented njagala kuberanga ndi musanyufu nga matide and with you but not without you atenga ndi nawe sagala kuberanga siri nawe have you understood otegedde that is proverbs 38 up to 9 okuva but- asatu yes you should uh, have a lot of money e mufune sente nyingi nyo use it muzikoze se use it not sparingly but what generously te muzikoze sa nga muzile sigaliza na ye muzikoze sereze dala amen pray the lord amen pray the lord amen so the wealthy have a great responsibility akati abagagga balino obuvunanyizibwa obwamanyi understand that god gave them money balino kutegera nti katonda yabawo obugagga yabawo essence must must have a responsibility not to pile it up eranga balino obuvunanyizibwa obwo obutazituma apa a christian cannot be within god's will and at the same time pile up money when people are dying omuloko etosobera kubera mukwagala kwa katonda ngo line sent ateno osigala ngo zitumi atabalalanga bwe bafa and they dig magazi gange no ogamata i made it my own wise men die abagaga nabagezi bafa so your wisdom is not what gave you money amagezi gosike gaku wa sent so your neighbor even wise men die mulirano wa mugament nabagezi bafa amen For example Socrates is dead. Okugeza Socrates yafa. The stupid and the senseless are like perish. Abasiru nawa abatalina magezi bajja kuzikirira. The wise and the fools will die alike. Abagezi na abasiru siru nabo bajja kufa. Their foolishness tell them that the houses are forever obusirusiru bwabwe bubagamba tya mayumba ge bazimbye gagenda kuberera amen 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 when they asked when in the classroom uh, i want to end now in the classroom olunako olumu in the psychology class in nairobi nabuza ekibina che nali nsoma ekya psychology nali nsonga nchasoma oh nali nchasoma the doctor the doctor was teaching us said that people uh should not get i was should not get hiv oh doctor yali atusomesa naga anti abantu tebalina kufuna sirim should be promiscuous should not be promiscuous abantu tebalina kubera benzi bakabakaba what they will get it was being taught in psychology because they were going to get uh, aids and they were die kubanga bali bagenda kufuna sirim bafe bwato bya tusomesa then I asked doctor. Nemobuza daktari oyo. Uh what about if a man is 95 years old? Kati omusajja bwabanga aline emyaka 95. What why should he go and uh, sleep with every woman? Get, even if she get he gets AIDS. Wachi tagenda ndi bakana buli mukazi ndi bwafuna sidi. Ndaba abana atero kufa. The teacher said. Omusomesa na gamba. Wewe chunga mudomo yako 
nti wegendereze bigambo byoyogera even if you are 95 you should be moral sigala ngo oline mpisa have morality sigala ngo oliwa mpisa but I was asking for the rest of the class. The, the devil was quickly speaking to them all. Have you understood? All those excuses you have. Your security, you should know that. Don't fool yourself. Your security is in God. The Bible says finally. I, I advise you to buy from me gold refined by fire. That you may become rich. And then have white garments. That you may clothe yourselves. Clothe yourselves. And that the shame of your nakedness may not be revealed. And I saw so, so to anoint your eyes. That you may see Revelation 3 and verse 18. Amen. Amen. Pray the Lord. God bless you very much.